Hi, welcome to my German lesson two. If you haven't seen my first video, go to my channel to watch it. Now, let's start. Previous lesson, we learned about family, animals, and some other stuff. So this is the second lesson, but it's still unit one. So yes, unit one basics. Lesson four adjectives with cute little snakes. Ein, ein means a. A can be this ein can be used for a, an, or one thing. This is also used for men, boys, and things. Things like, for example, books. And in German, we say books as buch, buch. And when you want to say like that is a boy, so it is a boy. Everything like that, you you pronounce as s, is. Bad handwriting. I'm just gonna change it. Okay, s, is. Ein, ein. Remember the ein. Junge, junge means boys. If you see my previous lesson, eine, eine also means a, and it can be used for a and or one thing. This is used for women, girls, food, and things. Things, for example, like newspaper. And in German, we say Zeitung. Zeitung is newspaper. So when you want to say that is it is a girl, so right as is hey okay all over again. So right as is ein no I know don't forget the e. Mansion. So I'm have to. Go, I'm gonna have to draw on the snake. Sorry, Mr. Snake. Mansion. Mansion means girl. Einen. Einen means a uh, also, and it can be used for a uh, and or one thing. This is used for food like apple. Then you say in German apple. App, you say the app, you know the game apps, whatever apps. App, full, app, full. Dust, dust. You pronounce it as dust without the t. Dust means that. You know that thing, that one. This can be used for the, that, or this. This is used for questions like "Where is the apple?" and in German we say "Wo ist das Apfel?" "Wo" you pronounce as "v" or "wo." "Wo ist das Apple?" "D" not "die." Mean "D" means "do." This is used for telling people things like. The orange is delicious, and in German we say the orange is lecker. You pronounce as orange, even though it's the same spelling. De, de means de. This is used for answering or asking questions, like if you're telling people and stuff like that. Like, is the dog part of the food chain? Oh yeah, this the is also meaning of the. That's why I see I I made it red so that you can see that it is of the food chain. Is that who threatens the Narumsketa? Narumsketa means food chain. Na. You pronounce as na room skater. Haba, haba means have. 
like I have this, you have that, it has this. This is used for me or I. Like how you say I have that and you say ich habe das. Ich means I. I have taught all of this in my previous lesson. Hat. Hat means has. It is used for he, she, or it. This is used for answering or asking questions or telling. It's all the same. She has a dog. The hat einen Hund. Hund means dog. I already taught it in the last lessons. Just preview it again. Hast. Hast means have. This is used for you. You. This is like, for example, you say you have a bird. And you say in German, du hast ein Vogel. Vogel. You pronounce it as wo, Vogel. Vogel. Vogel is a bird. Lesson five. Food. With cute little foods. Broad. Broad is bread. T. You just pronounce it as T. T means, well, T. Tomato. Tomato means tomato. It's the only difference is E and O. Strawberry. Strawberry in German is Erdbeer. Ad. Erdbeer. Erdbeer. Banana. Banana means banana. Just like just now, it's the only difference is the letters at the back. E and A. Apple means apple. Orange means orange. Pronounce as oran and A. Orange, we pronounce this as E, like the pronunciation sound. Kartoffel. Kartoffel means potato. You pronounce it as C A R car to fell. You know you fell down the fell. Pizza. Pizza, you pronounce it as pizza. Not pizza. In English we say pizza. Chocolate. We pronounce it as chocolade. Chocolade means chocolate. Ice. You pronounce it as ice. Like in English. Ice means ice cream. I. I. You pronounce it as I. I means egg. I. Kaza. Kaza means cheese. You just say K and then uh, Z. Kaza. Zupa. You pronounce it as Zu. Per. Zupa. No, it's exact. Zupa. Zupa means soup. You see these little two things in the bowl with the soup? No, then. Nu Delin. Nu Del. Just don't pronounce the Lin out so obviously. Nu Del means pasta. And that's the end of this lesson. And like after you listen all this, go to this link. I will put it later. I will put it in the description. And please, when after you done it please post your result at my facebook page i will also put the link down below and whoever finishes the quiz the fastest and gets all the answers correctly gets a free prize bye
see ya once again.